Thanks for rolling up. Too blunt, Marley. Certified pothead. Oh, finish one of my uh morning swift joints. Um. Let's get in here and do the thing, bro. So we know that it's a significant challenge in many communities. You literally drive around Etobicoke, drive, drive around other parts of the GTA and elsewhere, and you see that. Uh, we know that in other provinces they have uh, they have moved forward with uh, building in minimum distances that are required, similar to what's required, for example, around schools and other uh, other important public institutions. So we would pursue the same thing, working with our municipal partners at all times to make sure that the clustering that you referenced was no longer the case. It is one of the side effects, if I can put it this way, of the way that the Ford Conservatives dealt with the distribution of legalized cannabis. It's not good enough. Just having it be a random, arbitrary put process, not good enough. That's why Ontario Liberals will take action to make sure that clustering is dealt with responsibly. Because uh, what's, 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 what's happening around the, no, around, around? Okay. This nigga saying providences, so we in Canada. Ontario, I don't know. Is, is Ontario... A city or its own like 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 state. I don't I don't know Canada, bruh. I know now nah, I mean it was big news when Canada went uh wrecked for the whole country and shit. I was like, God damn, bruh. I got I'm trying to visit Canada. Well, we can do stone across the globe. <laughs> well, I'm stopping in Canada, bruh. First thing we gonna do is stone across the country, then we doing stone across the globe. Oh yo, All right, um, they having a problem with what uh stores too many stores being together does that mean that mean that means what um you might have seven stores on a block or like what well, if within a mile they all sell wheat <sighs> is that that big of a problem bro? Because understand something. All seven of them ain't getting the same volume. Even if you had them shits all on the same same road, bruh. They all ain't going to get the same volume. Some of them going to stand out. Some of them going to fall off. Uh, the legalization of cannabis has been in place now from the federal government uh, for a number of years, where by and large the industry has done a good job working with government to make sure that illegal cannabis is which was a serious concern before is no longer in the marketplace to the same extent especially for uh, the youngest people in ontario but we still have an issue as you pointed out around clustering that's why the ontario liberal plan will take a responsible approach not the hands-off kind of devil may care approach of the ford conservatives so whether we're talking about this issue clustering of cannabis stores or options or we're talking about handgun bans and the violent carjackings that we continue to see uh, ontario liberals will be responsible as we confront these challenges to keep people in this province safe which is Ontario got got car jackets and handguns and shit it's going down in Canada I don't know why I would think I was, I was thinking Canada was all just you know what I'm saying oh excuse me everybody how you doing I don't know why I thought <laughs> I don't know why I thought not me. Canada was all not me. That shit, those shit's going down to Canada. Okay. You know, one of the most important responsibilities that a premier is supposed to have, instead of consistently going into hiding the way that Doug Ford does. We gave it uh, the opportunity up to the municipalities to say yay or nay. Uh, and the ones that said yes, well, you're, you're seeing that. I, I see it too. You know, they'll cluster right beside each other. But guess what? It doesn't matter if it's cannabis or, or uh, you know, another type of a store. The market will take care of it. There's no way you can cluster any type of business beside each other. It's like putting six convenience stores together. There's going to be two that might survive. So, you know, folks, you know, it's first of all, it's up to the municipalities to determine that. And secondly, uh, the market's going to take care of the. Yeah. Uh, oh, I don't know Canada politics, politicians like that. Doug Ford, that name sounds familiar. Like, like, like. Uh, 
I don't know if that's the dude, but like, like, like Doug Ford, that name in crack. <laughs> the name Doug Ford and crack okay ring bells to me. Like, 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 uh, Mary and Mary and crack. I mean, ring, ring bells to me. Doug Ford and crack ring bells to me, bro. The rest of them, when they start clustering. Oh, all right, all right. So, 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 I guess, I guess we do got a problem in Canada. We're, you know, what I mean, there's 37, 37 weed stores. You know what I mean, just all, 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 all downtown Ontario. Uh, but, but, yeah, you know what I mean, crack, 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 crack cocaine for it and shit. You know what I mean, um, it's right, bro. You're right, bro. You, you can't have that many businesses together and think that they all gonna, they all gonna run. Yeah, let's, let's, let's do it. Let's do it logically, bro. Let's do it logically, bro. Um, let's say they all start off selling selling weed at the same price. What's well, gonna take is just one of them to say, "Yo, let me give let me give y'all niggas thirteen dollars off." Crowd gonna shift to thirteen dollars off. Think the other niggas gonna start doing the shit. So then they all now now you up in the air like, who the fuck gonna do some shit? You know what I mean? Um, and then the best one who's able to maintain. It's going to be the one who who who, who runs it, bro. It's a, it's simple supply and demand, bro. The simple supply and demand. I'll say this, bro. If you got four on a stroke, um, you might be able to get uh. You might be able to, you might be able to get uh. Yeah, two two to survive, but. Yeah, the mother two gonna go under, bro. 